it is paid into bank rupees 10,000. It means that you have deposited cash 10,000 into bank. So the money which was there with business, it is depositing into bank. So as a result in this transaction which is on 6th, cash is going out of the business into the bank. So bank is the organization, so personal account. So what is the rule of a personal account? Debit the receiver. So in this case bank is the receiver. So therefore we debit the bank. So we write bank account debit. Now what you are depositing into bank cash? Cash is real account. So the real account is credit what goes out. So here cash is going out therefore we credit it. So cash account. So bank account debit to cash the amount being 10,000 your narration would be being deposit of cash into bank or being cash deposited into bank. Now the last transaction on 7th paid salaries. Now salaries is what for the services of your employees you make a payment. So for anything paid for a service it is an expense. So the rule when it is an expense salaries becomes nominal. So therefore nominal account says the debit all expenses as a result of which we are debiting salaries. So salaries account debit paid means cash. Cash is real account it is going out so we credit cash. So salaries account debit to cash would be your journal entry. So the amount is 5000. Stop chain. Huh?